So the, the benefits of using this sort of new way of thinking, maybe it's not new, but this, this HOP way of thinking and the learning teams, the, the benefits that we're seeing are, for, for one thing, is really important, is employees, people that we would call the sharp end of the stick, the ones that are getting the work done out there, turning wrenches and making things happen, are really given a, a lot of respect in this. We realize that they're the ones that are making this work happen. And yes, we need leaders, we need engineers, we need directors and managers, but we also really, really need the people that are willing to do this hard work to make things happen. So the, one of the biggest benefits is something we've all been working at for a long time, is how do we get better sort of engagement and I would say collaboration. Because it's one thing for me to say I want employees to be more engaged, it's one thing for me to say I value you, collaborate with me, and see if we can't build better work. So we see that. Now some people say, well how do you measure this? Well, I don't know. Because we have so many metrics already, what I do say is watch your metrics and see what happens. In some cases, for example, injury rates may actually go up because people are now willing to talk about what's really happening and they're not hiding injuries. In some cases, we've seen the severity of injuries go down, way, way down. In some cases, we've seen organizations that were had phenomenal numbers that when we sort of peel back the, the outer layer and looked inside, were quite brittle. So the value is, is we're learning about reality. So, and that's why every organization doesn't do this. Many of them do not. It's becoming more common to talk about it, but it's not the new social norm. We still have plenty of companies that are not comfortable with knowing the, the way work really gets done.